Okay, here we are, day two of the experiment. I have managed to fix the iToy camera to my head, and I'm wearing it on a headband thingy. And I think my view of the paper will be better. So, I'm going to start off today not with a person, but with a car. looking car here Oop. I don't see that's what any research is for car has a bumper. Don't want to make an unsafe car. Gotta have more wheels. And it's a convertible. So our car driver can hang out with his elbow sticking over the side. on the wheel over here. There's the rest of the wheel. And Oh geez, that's an awful looking wheel. Lost my perspective there. Oh, I'm not supposed to be able to see this part because it's going underneath the car. Okay. And here's the back of our driver's seat here. And here's the trunk area of the car. Goes down that way. And there we go. And there's a back bumper that sticks out over this way got some exhaust coming out because he drives really fast and the owner of our little convertible sports car is some kind of a monster with a really wide face and he's very unhappy even though he owns a sports car, he has managed to be unhappy. And it makes him frown. He gets a big frowny face. And he's got some cheeks here. And weird looking ears. And some horns. Evil fast car driver. This guy here, he will talk on the cell phone, he will text, he'll do all those things that he's not supposed to do. And if he gets caught at it, then he has enough money to sue the cops. One day, 
our fast riding monster was headed downtown. Just gotta check the okay. And he came across a situation where there was a little boy in the middle of the street. Oh no! What's gonna happen? Oh he, he's all worried, he's got his eyebrows up. He knows something's gonna go weird. This guy's got to have an ear. And he's got to have some hair. Forehead. And let's see. Let's get an anime. Kind of loopy. Hair that curls back on itself magically. Type of hair. Monster, I'm in trouble. I'm in the street. Got my three fingers held up to tell you to stop. But our monster wasn't going to stop. Not for anything. Because he's a monster. And he feels that he's above the rules of society. And including the don't run over the guy standing in the street with his arms spread out. Set up. So the monster just kept barreling down on him. Um, and uh, no, don't hit me, monster. But little did he realize, till he got up on the boy, that this was no ordinary little boy. This little boy had tank treads instead of legs. And let's get some tank treads in here, give them a little bit of dimension. They're coming around that way. And they got like the bar things that go across here like that. And do 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 do. Don't hit me. But the evil monster kept barreling down on him. I don't know how these tank tread things work. This is how I always drew him as a little kid. And uh, at the end of it all, the little boy just drove over the top of the monster and crushed him and the car both. And the little boy is happy, and our monster is dead. Die, you bastard. The end.